up, what is up fam? Welcome to another Haunted Adventure. My name is Omar. Today I am with my wife Melissa and I have Patty from G Team Paranormal. We are going to investigate a house that's so haunted that the people that lived here before left in such a hurry. Can't wait to share this bit of history with you. Hope you're ready for this adventure. Let's do this. see that part of the garage has been kind of broken off to get in. When we got in here, I couldn't believe how much stuff was left behind. I mean, it looked like this house had probably been abandoned in the 1990s. Last time I was here, I seen a neighbor that was walking her dog and I asked her some questions. It's something that I like to do whenever I'm doing an investigation on a house. And to my surprise, yes, this house was haunted. I was just kind of taking a peek at it because I was in the market of looking for houses to buy. Now that neighbor told me that a doctor used to live here. I'm not sure if he was an archeologist. He was doing some research and went to another country and I guess brought something back evil to his home and it affected the entire family to the point where they all had to leave and they ended up leaving so much stuff behind. Now from the looks of it, this has been sitting behind for a long time. I mean, I'm looking at VCRs, I think I even seen some old cameras from like the 1990s. So this has been sitting here for a really, really long time. But one thing about spirits, they are eternal. If there's something evil in this house, it's probably still lurking. We're going to find out. Let's have a look around though. Some cassette tapes there. Yeah, there's the VCR I was talking about. Seen quite a few of those. I don't see those very much anymore. Right, look at these old clothes. I even left the laptop behind. This is such a big place here that Patty and Melissa already started doing some investigating in here. Hey, Patty. And they even left food behind. This is crazy. What's up, guys? Just getting a tour here. This is this house is this is uh, something else. Did you see this in here? Whoa! Whoa! What is this? Those are satellite crystals right there on each side. Of what does that mean? Those are very highly protective crystals. Those are like the crystals that we use that I've been telling you about that I use all the time and they're good for protection. How would they be sitting here? Into something here. Look, I found this picture here. Looks like it's maybe in a different country or something. Here's another one. I'm covering up his face, but I'm thinking that was the doctor that used to live here. Maybe he was doing some, you know, some traveling and helping people out in other countries. That's really nice of him. I thought he was an archaeologist though. Could be wrong. When was this taken? It doesn't even say. There's more of those crystals laying around. Are they? Yeah. These are amazing uh, crystals. They're really good. Are those expensive? Yeah. Are they? They can be quite expensive, yeah. I wonder what they were doing with this. I don't know. Maybe some type of uh, ritual or. Maybe a cleansing? cleansing like some yeah. kind of cleansing? I 
swear I heard something coming from up there. It was like a knocker, like a boom. Oh, here's some more pictures. I'm not sure what country that is right there. It's like pictures here from a country. Oh, look, a parrot. Cool. The pictures from a different country, it looks like for sure. Yeah. I mean, we don't even see those anymore. Like prints. There's still right there. Yeah, I was going to tell you that. There's a ton of them. There's a whole box here. What kind of crystals are these? I don't know. On some of them, I recognize them. I just can't think of the names. But oh, I look at that. It's an entire box of like oh my exotic gosh. rocks. Patty's in heaven right now. I am. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at all of this. Dude, what is this? Look what I found. Whoa. What is that? That doesn't look like it. it's from here. It doesn't. I, I don't, you don't see stuff like that here. Maybe like this one, but not these other ones. That's so weird. Country. And was it wrapped up in this? Hindu? Yeah, but Let me know in the comments what you think this is from. I'm not sure why it was wrapped up and kind of hidden here. Maybe somebody hid it because they wanted to come back and grab it. That looks like real gold too. Ladies were getting a little hot, so they went outside. Can't wait to show you how beautiful the pool is. There's even some animals in it. I'll explain more in a little bit. I think this is the master bedroom. This is the family room. And this must be, I don't know, this is probably the family room. That's the formal living. Yeah, beautiful mm -hmm. one. Oh, it smells like mold in here. Hello? It's not like somebody was in this room with me. So weird. It was like super dark in here and then like I heard footsteps or something. Whoa. Whoa. The crawling eye. The nightmare terror of the slithering eye that unleashed agonizing horror on a screaming world. <laughs> So much cool stuff here. Now, I'm not trying to take anything. I'm just really curious, like what people leave behind, you know. And for, I mean, I've seen seen it countless times when it comes to like foreclosures and stuff like that. Like people will leave stuff behind, but this is a little bit different. This wasn't finances, you know. I mean, a doctor lived here. Pretty sure he had quite a bit of money. I'm not saying that doctors don't have financial problems. This family was being terrorized by something evil in this house. Oh, how pretty. Damn, look at this. They even left shampoo and conditioner and stuff. Wow. They left a lot behind, even toilet paper. Not gonna lie, that toilet angled like that. Looks kind of cool. No way. No freaking way. Dang, look at that. I just found my new vlog camera. Scratch that. Here's my new vlog camera. Dang, this is so cool. What? Wow. Oh, I remember this camera right here. That was like one of the first digital cameras ever with a screen. Dang, that's so cool. Oh, no way. I used to have this camera. This is my first digital camera ever. Sony Mavica, it would use a floppy disk. How convenient is that? Why would they just leave that behind? What is that, a mobile DVD player? Man, one of a kind. There's so much stuff here. I mean, it has to be worth money. Hmm. Teeth whitening. It's starting to get dark out. Just 
Peggy Moore is outside. What are you guys doing? Did you guys did you guys hear something? No. Uh, here, just a little break. It was hot in there. I like heard a noise and, and like I don't know there was these like like a broom or something on the in the corner and it fell. Oh. Uh, what what kind of crystals are these? Protective crystals. Protective crystals. They just started burning my my wrist right now. Maybe someone's trying to attack you. Something might be trying to attack you. You think so? Maybe that doctor was here, was not a regular doctor. Maybe he was some type of, into like voodooism or, or some kind of crazy stuff, you know? I mean, he could have been a witch doctor. I mean, there could be a lot of things, you know, that he could have been. No one's been specific on what kind of doctor he is. No, I don't know. So? I did find something cool, though. You did? Yeah, come check this out. Okay. It's right over here. So... This, this was standing in the corner like this. And I think I got it on camera. Like I heard like a tap, like a light. And then all of a sudden this went like that. Right in front of me. I'm not even kidding you. That's one of my childhood fears, believe it or not. Like I used to live in a haunted house and I watched a mattress that was on. This is for real. I had, there was a mattress up against the the wall like this and I watched it, it was at an angle and I watched it go like that right in front of me so it was almost like it knew one of my fears as a kid and it did the very same thing I mean, just not a mattress but that's not what I wanted to show you though yeah, I was in here last time hopefully it's still here I think he was like studying some kind of Judaism or something like that look, I found this maybe, maybe he was Jewish what's this? Oh, it's a flag, I think. Whoa! What was that? You heard that? That's right when I started messing with that. Let's go, let's go over there. I thought the the broom and the you know oh, well there are two brooms. I thought they moved again, but they didn't. Oh, you think it was that? The crystals? The crystals fell. We were standing up. We didn't really get to it. Oh my God. How about you just heard? How about you just heard? Well, I don't know. Is it, did it sound like this? Kind of. Dude, that scared the crap out of me. Dude, now how will those crystals just fall over like that? I don't know, maybe a rush of wind or something? It's so high. Oh, did you just hear that? No, no. What was it? Again, I heard it again. Yeah. Shh, shh. What if somebody lives here? Some squatters. I hear voices. I'm telling you, I, I heard... Door. What? The door, but that wasn't open a second ago, was it? No, maybe that's one of the noises that we heard. There's somebody in there? I'm telling you, I heard somebody walking behind me too earlier. And you guys were outside. What's in there? There's like a trap door. Whoa. Dude, there's a trap door. Is somebody in there? I just heard a whisper. I wonder what's on the other side of that. I don't know. 
Oh! What was that? Whoa, that thing moved. Dude, that door just popped out. Hello? Somebody down here? Yo, it's like all insulated in there. Hold on. I'm gonna go in there. There's like carpet under here. It smells funky. Yeah, I like that butt shot. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Hello? Yeah, it smells really... What? You heard something upstairs? This is swears you heard something up here. Sounds like fun. Heard that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's pretty hot. Damn, this thing is burning me. I don't know why. Are those paintballs? I think so. Cool. Look at all these paintballs. So many of them. Oh, dude, look at this. Look what I found. Look, freaking trumpet. Whoa. I used to play trumpet in high school. Oh gosh. There's a, an attic over here. Oh, you thought it was hot in there? Man, there is so much stuff left behind. Whoa, 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 what? What's the matter? You heard whispering? Yes, big time. Whispering. We should go downstairs for me right now, but I didn't hear it. I think somebody's here. Yeah, look at the old school TVs. There's some old Air Jordans over there too. What's in here? Whoa. I don't always sweat, but when I do, it happens in a haunted house. It's 91 degrees Fahrenheit. All right, that's still there, which is good. I've never had that happen to me. Like, I wear protective, you know, stones and crystals a lot. And this was legit. Like, it happened maybe two or three times, like burning my wrist. I'll yeah. I'll go with you. I'm gonna go out here to the pool. It is so jungly. Huh? What's up? I heard a real loud noise in there again. Did you really? Yeah. What broom? That was in the first room? Nah. Are you sure? Let me see. Standing right, it was standing upright, wasn't it? From what I can remember. Yo, I closed that door. I closed that door. Closed the door? Yeah. I think it was closed when we came out. It was it was closed when we came out. Because I looked over it. What are you talking about with the broom? There's br the brooms are right there. What? Yeah. Yeah, no way. Oh, what? What is that?
Are you talking about that broom? Yeah, is that there the whole time? That had to have been here. Maybe it was. Oh, so we were in this room. I'm getting the rooms confused. Yeah, all these rooms look like. So, hey, I wanted to show you the pool area. And yes, there is an animal living in here. What kind of animal? An alligator. I'm just kidding. There's tadpoles though. They're growing into frogs. How cool. You can see them growing. Hi, guys. Oh, look, there's, there's a frog right there. Hi, little baby. Oh, you're so cute. Whoa. Look at all these tadpoles. You guys better hurry up and grow. You're so cute. Now, I know the difference between a tadpole and a fish, and there are fish in this pool. Not sure how they got here, but they're in here. Look, right there. There's a fish right there. See? See if I can zoom into them. That is not a tadpole right there. That is a fish. way different than a tadpole how the hell did a fish get in this pool like i just i just want to know like does that happen when you don't take care of your pool like fish end up just popping up in your pool like i know the difference look these guys are tadpoles but there are minnows in here look like that's a tadpole i know that's a tadpole that's a tadpole like they have round heads but what i just seen right now was a fish Ew! Gross! Cannibalism! Oh, it's a spiritual doctor? Are you serious? Whoa! That thing is pretty stubborn too. It usually, yeah. like, whoa! Look, it just spiked. Oh my god! It, it takes a lot for it to do that. Holy moly! This place is really active. Do you want us to leave? What did I say? That's talking a lot today. Yeah. I asked how many spirits is that seven? Yeah. Seven spirits? Did he set his person from the candle up like this? They even left aluminum foil behind. This thing is going crazy. Now I walked away for a little bit and I was like snooping around and Patty said that she heard an EVP that said it's God or something like that. Maybe God is protecting this house now. Oh, you saw a cardinal? Mm -hmm. Really? It's right there. And cardinals are a sign of angels are around you. What's the sign of a deer? I don't think it's anything bad, to be honest with you. Oh, he's wagging his tail. When I was in the master bedroom, I guess I missed something that Melissa found. 
Whoa! These are all syringes. What the heck? Why am I even touching this right now? What is this for? I wonder what's in this box. Vials. What is that? Yeah. What is that? What is this for? Why, why would this be in like... Huh? Well, this is a nurse. So she knows all That's about it. That's funny, Patty said the same thing. Did she? Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually a needle. It looks like for an IV or something. Like, what do you think that was used for here in the house? Like, like that's not like a regular syringe for medicine. It's like something for a, I mean, I don't know. I'm not a doctor. I am not a doctor. Quit touching it. It's still, I hope someone had lice in this house. Uh, I'm really like wondering what's on those tapes. Really curious. Doesn't even have a screen. Where did my dad have one of these? So what did my dad? He still has that actually. Yeah, he'd be like, like this. Right. Like, hey guys, <laughs> happy birthday to you. Hey, could you imagine? <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to another haunted adventure. My name is Omar, and today, oh my gosh, this thing's heavy. Oh my gosh, is that what like vloggers used to use back in the day? Yeah, it needs power. Power. All right, fam, that is going to conclude today's adventure. Make sure to check out my friend Patty from G Team Paranormal. And if you want to see more of this young lady in my videos, just watch my videos more because <laughs> she's in a lot of them. And she's especially in a lot of my daily vlogs. Do have another channel. I mean, sometimes I might miss a day or two, you know, when I'm uploading for this channel. But for the most part, I do upload a lot there. I also got some fresh merch. Be sure to check it out. Also, let us know if you want us to return to this house. I'm thinking about maybe doing an overnight challenge here. I think that should be fun. Let me know in the comments if you want us to come back here at nighttime. Maybe do a lights out challenge. Maybe do a, a one of those alone 30 minute challenge, alone challenges. I don't know. Let me know here in the comments. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and let you go. Thanks for coming along. If you haven't already, make sure to give this video a like. Gotta go before you leave. Give it a kiss. Peace.